go inside of Canva and make your own word search, okay? So you're gonna head over to Canva. In the search bar, you're gonna type in word search. Now Canva, they already have several different templates that you can use. Let me put a space here because it helps with what comes up. Okay, I wanted to use this one. So you type in word search, you have all of these great templates to choose from. I'm gonna go ahead and choose this one here and you're gonna click on customize this template. And then you see there is one, two, three, four, I believe there's 12 words that we can put here. So I already have my words ready. So I'm gonna go in and add those words. Okay, so let me grab the words that I have here. Okay, so for this first word, I'm gonna do 12 positive affirmation words. So, go here to cat and I'm just gonna paste empowered. And then I'm gonna go back through, sorry, <laughs> and do this for all of my words. Let me close some of my windows. I'm sorry, my screen is so uh, messy. I have so many things on my screen. Okay, so go to radiant. So I'm literally just going through each word and copy and pasting. Now I did have these words prepared and ready. It's 12 words. Okay, we're gonna speed this up so you don't have to sit through all of this, but you get the gist, you see what I'm doing. Taking my 12 words and putting them here in this little key area. Okay, so all of my words are here. Instead of animals word search, I'm just gonna put positive, affirmation and then I am going to go back and change the look of this but I'm not going to do that now okay so find and circle the words related to the animals below uh, let's see I'll just put find and circle the words uh, that you see below Okay, so now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna put each of these words here, okay? So I'm definitely gonna speed this up, but you'll see exactly what I'm gonna do. So empowered, I'm gonna put it on this top line. And then literally you can just watch me fill the rest of this out. And I'm gonna speed it up a bit.
Okay, so I absolutely know that I have some of these words wrong because as you're creating, you're going to see that you kind of run into um, a little jam and you have to make sure like harmonious, I have that there. And then I had, it was running into abundant. So you'll have to go back through and fix things. But for the sake of time, I don't want to go through all of that. You pretty much get the gist. Um, now I'm going to go through and I'm going to change this to colors that I would want this to be. So I'll, I'll, uh, style it and you can see what I'll, I would do for my own. Okay. So this, I'm going to change this to something else. I would probably take affirmate or I would take positive and let's put a space here. And then So then I'll take this and I would just change this to like a tan background and then I might add some type of, um, let's see, something in the back here, let's see, flowers. I'm gonna color this white and then I'll position this all the way to the back so it's a part of the background here. I'll literally just kind of duplicate this and put it in different places in the back there. And then I will probably change these to all of this tan color. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and download this as a PDF. And then you can print this. Now, let's say you, I don't know if you have some type of an event, um, maybe some type of gathering. This could just be like an icebreaker. Um, you can use this for whatever you need to use it for. You can even think about um, uploading this to Etsy. Um, you know, you can niche down to different uh, markets or whatever and make word searches for different markets that people can use um, with whatever programs that they have going on. So if you take a look at this, this is how the finished product looks.